Captain Janet Eju, how prepared are you and your team ahead of the competition? Um, we are very prepared and our aim is to win this tournament but we are going to take match after match so we are very prepared for this tournament. What should Ghanaians expect from Hazaki Sleeps? Uh, nothing but a win and Ghanaians should uh, continue playing for us and support us. We are here to uh, define the good name of Ghana so we are very, very ready for this tournament. Ready. Let's go. Right, 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 right. Teach me, teach me, keep on. The movement of the hand, the movement of our blessing, the movement of the hand. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Two seconds more. Ten seconds more. Finish, finish. Finally, you've arrived in Egypt. You have a mission. What should Ghanaians expect from you as uh, you're about to start your competition? Thank you very much. Um, we are here with one ambition. And uh, our objective is to ensure that we, re uh, we raise the image of Ghana very high to make Ghanaians very, very proud. Because um, all the eight clubs are here for the ultimate, and of course, Hazakes Didi is no exception. How well do you know your opponents in your group? Well, um, even in the course of the game, I'll be able to know them very well because, um, looking at their clips, probably even the players that I saw might not even start or something. Uh, it was just to give me a fair idea of how the team play, not individually. So for now, I will say that um, to know my opponent very well is when the game starts. How are you blending the new players in the team together with the old players? Yeah, that is why I didn't bring uh, many players, just about three, four players. And um, already those players, are apart from um, Asana, um, if you look at Blessing, I have coached her 2018 up to last year. So at least she knows my philosophy or my principles of play and the team tactics as well because uh, most of what, uh, the things that we do here is here. So at least she knows my philosophy or my principles of play and the team tactics as well because uh, most of what, uh, the things that we do here we apply it in the national team as well, so at least she's no new to my taxes. And I'll say that um, uh, they are doing well. Hazakis Ladies is representing West Africa as well as Ghana. As the head coach, what should Ghanaians expect? And secondly, is there so much pressure on you and your team? Not at all. We are, you can see that we're taking it easy. We were taking it easy, so um, that is the the psyche of uh, players you know we didn't do any intensive work we made them to do losing up with a fun game which is the footballing which they all enjoyed very well so um, I think that uh, there is no pressure on us at all that is why we didn't uh, 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 said, uh, we didn't uh, put the pressure on us by saying that uh, we are coming to win the ultimate by all means no it, it is our target. What's your final message for people back home? Well, um, as usual, the support that they've been giving us with the necessary and the needed of uh, prayers, we need it. But we are here in the name of Ghana, so here is Hazakas Ladies of Ghana. So uh, Ghanaians should rally behind us, and uh, uh, at the end of it all, we are.